Where Do Puddles Go? by Faye Robinson Do you like to watch the rain pour down from the sky, soaking trees and plants and streets and sidewalks? Then, right after it rains, do you ever put on your boots and jump in the puddles? When the sun comes out, everything dries up and the puddles disappear. Where do they go? Puddles dry up because of the sun. Heat from the sun warms the smallest parts of each drop of water. Warm air rises and the tiny bits of water rise too. They become part of the air. This is called evaporation. Water that has evaporated is called water vapor. Water vapor is invisible. You can't see it. If you can't see it, how do you know it's there? Here is one way to prove it. Set a glass of ice water in the sun. Soon, water will start to drip down the outside of the glass. It didn't leak out of the glass. It's water that was in the air. When water vapor is cooled, it turns back into water. This is called condensation. Water vapor rises high into the sky. The air is cooler up there, so the water vapor condenses. Tiny water droplets join with other droplets and soon there are so many droplets in one place that you can see them. That's what clouds are. There are different kinds of clouds. Some are big and puffy and white. Some are so full of water that they turn gray. Then heavy drops of water fall to the ground as rain. If it is cold enough outside, it snows instead. Rainwater doesn't always evaporate right away. A lot of it trickles into streams and rivers. The streams and rivers flow into lakes and oceans. The sun heats them up like giant puddles. Water on the surface evaporates, rises into the sky, collects as clouds and falls as rain again. This pattern is called the water cycle. The water cycle never stops. All the water we have on earth is all we ever had. From prehistoric times until now, the same water is used over and over and over again. That's one good reason to take care of it. The water you use today may someday fall in a mountain snowstorm, crash over a cliff in a waterfall, spout from a whale in an ocean, or fill a puddle you jump in right after it rains.